Okay, welcome and hello. Thank you for joining us today. So we're going to be talking about the amazing power of Fucoidin. And uh, if you're watching the recording, thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch the recording. And no matter where you are in the world, what time or day or night, we appreciate you getting on the call or watching the recording. So I've got the lovely Ian Chabelle with me this afternoon. And um, Ian's really passionate about the topic, as am I, of Fucoidin. This is an amazing ingredient uh, that is well worth learning as much as you can about because it can have amazing benefits for yourself, your family members and friends. And that's the topic we want to talk on today. So um, Ian's also got a background in, uh, I guess, science and an engineer, engineering science, and is very interested in nutrition. Um, he was with Tom's previous company and uh, actually had a big team there and helped a lot of people with the nutritional products then. And uh, I've recently completed my qualification as a nutrition and health coach. And so just love sharing lifestyle changes and information about health that can really help and benefit you. So we're going to start the slideshow today. And uh, we might be missing a few people. It may be that they've got on, if Kurt sent out his link, Ian, instead of mine, that may be the case there. Um, do you want to say a quick hello? Hi, Katie. Thanks for the introduction. That was fantastic. Yeah, I'm, it's truly a, a very passionate subject. Um, I, I take it uh, every day. So it's it's an amazing product. And the things that it can do for you are also very amazing. So as we yeah. go through the slides today, um, I think we'll find out what we're talking about. Yeah, fantastic. So we are talking about the ingredient Fucoidin, F-U-C-O-I-D-A-N. And um, this particular ingredient that we're talking about, we're talking about the one that comes from Limimu seaweeds. Uh, first, a disclaimer here that uh, we're not uh, intending to treat, diagnose, prevent or cure any disease or illness. The information has not been evaluated by the FDA. We're not talking specifically about any products. We are sharing information and research on the ingredient for coitin. So you can go away and um, find out for yourself if this is something you want to look into or do further research into. And you can always get back to the person that shares this information with you. Uh, if you are unwell. Um, please do consult a qualified healthcare professional. Uh, and, you know, if you're wanting to take um, an ingredient such as Fucoidin, it's a good idea to check with them as well. So, Ian, I'll hand over the first slide to you. Okay. You know, we, first of all, we need to understand a little bit about what is Fucoidin. And we're not going to get too much into the, the really chemistry of it, but we're going to give you an overview of it, which is, now, Fucoidin is a, a natural substance and um, it's found in the cell walls of certain kinds of seaweed, brown seaweed, and the particular one we're talking about today is Limu Maui. Um, it's one of the, the, the seaweeds that is extremely pristine. It has no pollutants in its, uh, and it re remarkably, it's, it's one of the most powerful um, uh, sulfates that are around. So um, the other thing is that uh, what you know? What does Fucoidin do for the body? So, in 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 essence, here the health benefits of Fucoidin um, extract and reveal a phenomenal variety of actions. They include protection, and this is really important from viral infections, blood clots, osteoarthritis, kidney and liver diseases, chemotherapy, and radiotherapy damage. Now, we'll expand a bit of that as we go through yeah. um, in the next slides. Thanks, Katie. Awesome. And so you can see the reference here. So um, we're putting references on everything where we're getting the information from. So that's from a PubMed study and the article reference is at the bottom of the slide that you can see there. Uh, so as Ian mentioned that Fucoidin uh, refers to a group of highly complex polysaccharides. So these are all really kind of fancy words, but what does that mean? It means it's simple sugars that are linked together in a, in a special matrix. Um, and it also uh, a key component of Fucoidin is sulfate. So scientists refer to fucoidin as a sulfonated polysaccharide. So uh, sulfonated polysaccharides have a lot of benefits when we're gonna get into the amazing benefits of this. And it has um, drawn a lot of scientific attention because it occurs widely on cell surfaces in humans and other mammal, mammals, in plants, insects, kelp, and mushrooms. So 
the activity of fucoidin in animals are at least partially due to the role of fucose in cell communication. So quite a bit of science there. So what do you really need to know from that? That um, it's really a polysaccharide and um, the sulfonated component of it. So we're gonna to touch on more on how that's relevant. So Ian, I'll hand this slide to you. Okay, so one of the things that's really important in our body is that um, uh, things called stem cells. And these stem cells, as we can see from the slide, have the ability to transform into different kinds of cells. For example, if you cut yourself and the process of healing is due to various kinds of cells, of the stem cells. So we rely on stem cells to replace cells that we lose from aging and other sources of cellular damage, like being a cut finger or something like that. Accordant is known as a highly effective stem cell mobilizer, so it's able to move stem cells into areas that are required. This means that it acts to help move stem cells to where they are needed for cellular replacement. In addition, Facoidin has been shown to amplify populations of certain kinds of stem cells to go where they're needed. Thanks, yeah. Katie. Fantastic. And there's also a PubMed um, reference there. Yep, at the bottom. So that's where the information's come from. Yeah, so boosting stem cells due to damage from chemotherapy and radiotherapy is now under study for its use in recovery from cancer treatments. Um, this is really, really important area. And uh, this is just one aspect of potential clinical value of fucoidin, the ingredient. Uh, in addition, it has been shown to rescue aging stem cells that are important for rebuilding the inner walls of damaged blood vessels so this happens when someone, you know, obviously goes through chemotherapy um, and radiotherapy, the cells, good and bad cells get damaged. Obviously, they want to kill off all the bad cells. Um, but in the process, the healthy cells get attacked as well. And, you know, Fucoidin uh, has shown in some studies to provide tremendous benefit uh, there. So this is something really worth keeping in mind and keeping that in the back of your mind, because this is the sort of information that you could share with someone that could really make a big difference to them. And you can check the reference there at the bottom from PubMed. So this one is a power of Accordion. We're going to look at um, the power of Accordion centers around the potent and healthy benefits of a Accordion found in Limu Maui. Now this is, we were talking about Limu Maui, it's a specific type of, of seaweed that's found um, off the Tongan coast. And it's, a, as I said, it's a pristine, non-polluted type stuff. So it's actually very, very pure. The yeah. Powerpack super nutrient has been used for centuries in Tonga, in Japan and other areas of the Southeast seas because of its ability to increase well-being and to regenerate healthy cells. Yeah, incredible. So um, fucoidin and cancer. So recent research shows that fucoidin does indeed have multiple effects against various kinds of cancers. Uh, this is according to the studies that have been done and are available on PubMed. The reference is down the bottom. Uh, so one of the activity of fucoidin is to help regulate key molecules that drive the destruction of tumor cells. And another is fucoidin's ability to slow down the formation of vascular tissue that feeds tumor growth. Uh, and as mentioned before, fucoidin uh, acts as an adjunct uh, that synergizes with anti-cancer chemotherapy agents. This is a key property that makes chemotherapy more effective at lower dosages, thereby reducing its to toxic effects. And there's studies um, on PubMed there showing that, that when it was administered in conjunction with the traditional um, the chemotherapy treatments, the effect was much greater and uh, less side effects, which is really just incredible. So again, that's sort of coming back to using the best of both worlds, the best of science and nature, and combining both um, types of, you know, natural and traditional uh, medical treatments. And of course, as I mentioned before, if you are unwell or if you are suffering from cancer or any other illness, please do consult with your doctor. This is um, some of the, uh, the amazing powers of Pacoidin. And in this particular case here, Coid induces apoptosis, which destroys cancer cells by themselves. And I'll just read this because the human body is made up of almost 60 trillion cells. The cells produce new cells by metabolism and old cells die. And that's the apoptosis. It consists of this cycle, but unfortunately cancer cells do not apply to this regular cycle. Cancer cells seldom die, but they multiply and metastasize. 
So here we've got for coitin has a function to let cancer cells die by themselves. The coitin taken into the body pre presses the suicide switch of cancer cells when it is in touch with them. So these those cancer cells die out. And from the diagram on the side there, you can see that we have a cancer cell and we have for coitin and it's pressing the, the particular wow. suicide switch. Yeah. And so sorry, that... Sorry, sorry. Yeah, I was just going to say that information is from um, the book, um, which we'll share late, a bit later on the presentation. So, yeah, you can go back and reference the book as well as where this information okay. has come from. Yep, go on. For coitin, this is number two. For coitin yep. removes helibacter, the helicobacter pylori, which is a, a, a stomach um, bacteria, and it causes stomach ulcers and stomach cancer. So Helicobacter sorry, Helicobacter pylori is a bacteria which lives in the stomach of human beings. A recent study has revealed that Helicobacter pylori causes stomach ulcers, stomach cancer, and duodenal ulcers. As Helicobacter pylori creeps in under the mucus of the stomach, it resides in the stomach. All along. All along, unless all along, less there is a strong pylori eradication. Sorry, Helicobacter pylori. Go to the yeah. Has, has, has to its own nature sticking to the sulfates. So what we're talking about here is is um, is because um, for coitin is a sulfated uh, molecule that this bacteria will adhere to this bacteria to the sulfate molecule of the of of the phacoidin. So it's just, and so then it's discharged from the body while it sticks to the phacoidin because phacoidin contains an abundance of sulfate groups. So yeah. stomach cancer has the highest number of medical cases among cancer phacoidin cancers. Phacoidin could be always a big help to care for your stomach. I think yeah. Katie mentioned a reference. Yeah, so the reference um, is from the book uh, and I'll just share we'll share that in the next few slides so if you want to find this information um, you can go there and it is written by a doctor this book um, so we've got the next um, point here which is point three do you want to go through that one Ian? yeah sure this this one's um, it's the self-healing power of the human body uh, this is a, a my natural healing ability which cures bad health is originally in the human body. So we've got our own immune system, which is, has the ability to, in, in almost all cases, to eradicate any abnormal cell structures. However, it's said that cancer, allergy and life-related diseases are increasing since modern humans have a weak ability. And this is because we, we have to fight toxins and different things uh, in our lifestyle. A lymphocyte called NK, which is, stands for natural killer cell, which always remains in existence in the human body and fight against cancer cell or cell infected with bacteria. NK or natural killer cells recognize fucoidin as a toxin. In this case, it looks at as a, as a, a foreign object. Yeah, fantastic. A, sorry. <laughs> um, and or, yeah, so is it? Yeah, Fucoidin is a toxin substance in human body. A lymphocyte activates more, more. So, defense and immunity can be improved with immunity. When improved, when immunity improves, many diseases are suppressed, and natural human healing power is strengthened. So, as a result, a probability of developing the disease becomes lower. The power of fucoidin can assist you to build up your body. So, what we're saying here is, is that Facoidin actually activates the NK cells, and so against uh, any any uh, runaway cells or any cells that look like they're going to um, going to cause any challenges. Yeah. And on the diagram on the right there, you can see that facoidin has actually um, given the natural killer cells a bit of a push, and so it, it ends up um, attaching to the cancer cells and eventually eradicating them. Yeah, fantastic. And so this reference is from The Amazing Power of Fucoidin, uh, published 2016. It's available on Amazon, this book, and it's by um, Denshi Takagawa. It's a Japanese um, gentleman, a doctor, I believe, and 
yeah so you can purchase that book online to find out more so we've also got lots of anti-aging benefits of fucoidin as well so it's found that fucoidin does play a role in activating activating key enzymes that influence lifespan so we've heard about the situin genes um, with the ingredient resveratrol which we touched on last week over situin 6 which is one of the seven situin enzymes that influence a wide range of cellular processes in humans um, this particular uh, situin 6 is important because it controls healthy aging and regulating genome stability so your dna oxidative stress and glucose metabolism um, it also shows as a promising target for age-related diseases the situin gene does chronic inflammation, metabolic syndrome, obesity, and insulin resistance type two diabetes. So there's lots of uh, potential benefits there. And uh, actually um, Ian was fascinated to find out it's the only polysaccharide at this time that is known to stimulate the situin six gene. So further research is needed and um, how it could also impact on other situins. So there's a PubMed reference at the bottom, so you can check that out. Um, if you're watching the recording, you can pause it and uh, copy that down with a pen and paper if you want to go check that out. Now we're just up to uh, this part here, which is talking about the studies that we've been referring to. And, and there are many, many other studies. There's over 2,600 scientific studies on PubMed. And uh, many have shown the powerful nutritional supporting properties of fucoidin from the Limimu seaweed. That's where it comes from. So people have, who have regular fucoidin in their diets may, may enjoy substantial advantages of good health. And so I've just added in a few extra slides here, just so you can see that if you go to PubMed, if you go to pubmed.gov, it, it'll um, automatically redirect to this URL here, which is um, ncbi.mlm.nih.gov. Um, but anyway, if you just remember pubmed.gov and you can go on there and you can check out um, the ingredient Fucoidin, F-U-C-O-I-D-A-N, and all these great studies come up on this. Um, so you can see here, just looking at some of the titles, anti-inflammatory acti activity of Fucoidin extracts in vitro, um, got um, immunology, uh, sorry, immunomodularity and anti-inflammatory effects of Fucoidin, a review, Fucoidin and lung function, uh, value in viral infections, uh, protective effects of fucoidin against kidney diseases, uh, fucoidin as a potential therapeutic for major blinding diseases, um, fucoidin and its application as building blocks of nutraceutical delivery systems. So there's just thousands of studies, uh, to, uh, as I said, over 2,600. So do go on there, have a look if you are that type of person that wants more information, but you can see there's lots of uh, scientific research behind this ingredient. So if we just summarize here today, so fucoidin provides the cellular nutrition your body needs to keep cells healthy um, and helps them regenerate at a much better rate than the unhealthy ones, healthy cells. Fucoidin helps your immune system. It can help your immune system to operate at peak performance levels. It can help with digestion. A shot of fucoidin after meals can help digestive system work better and more effectively and efficiently. Fucoidin supports healthier, happier lives. The ingredient combined to help your liver function at its best. Uh, Fucoidin's base is limimu and the superfood of the sea. Scientific studies have proven the nutritional value of this sea vegetable and its um, nutritional elements. So the islanders have loved it for centuries. This is the book, um, Amazing Fucoidin, the collected stories by people who have been revived with Fucoidin. Uh, so do check that out. Here's one testimonial from the book. Since I started taking Fucoidin, I've noticed more mobility in my joints, more endurance and less discomfort. After riding my bike for long periods of time, I'm sleeping better. I mentally, I mentally feel stronger. I highly recommend this product for its regenerative properties. And I love the fact that it's backed by significant science and research. And uh, here's another testimonial from the book. Um, so a support of my health is now Fucoidin, a natural constitute that is my determination after going through a major operation and a struggle with cancers. Um, so this book was translated from Japanese to English, and uh, that's a well-known TV personality. Um, it's always a tricky pronouncing um, the name sometimes, Yashiko Takumuku. Uh, perhaps it's incorrect, but you can read that for yourself. So, yeah, another great testimonial. So in summary, from the book, um, The Amazing Fukuiden, the book, Fukuiden is uh, the ocean's gift of health and what doctors are saying about it. So if you co contain, contains the same type of antibodies 
found in mother's milk. So often bucoidin is referred to as mother's milk. So it's, it contains the same type of antibodies found in mother's milk in the first week. Um, that was from a prominent Japanese researcher. Anyone who is on prescription medication, eats poorly, has stress, or just wants to feel better should be taking fucoidin. Um, he is unwavering in his belief that everyone breathing should be taking it. Dr. De Silva, MD, uh, JFK Medical Center researcher. And there are so many supplements that can impact individual systems, but I've never seen a single supplement that can have an effect on so many different systems at once. And that's from Dr. Ron Shula. So just incredible information. So now you might be asking, well, this is all great. Um, I love the information you've shared on this ingredient, fucoidin, and I can see there's a lot of research on it. How would I go about finding the best type of fucoidin? So you'd want to find a company that uses a process to sulfonate all eight molecules of the fucoidin. Um, this makes it more, more effective and concentrated and bioavailable. Most fucoidin breeds only have one of the eight molecules. You want to use, uh, find a manufacturer that uses a sulfonated process, such as a Limimu spray dryer, and a manufacturer that uses concentrated extracts of seaweed that contains all three types of fucoidin, U, F, and G, um, because this makes for an amazing supplement and helps with the taste and obviously helps you to feel great. And also we talked about where the seaweed comes from. So Tonga uh, is a really rich source of fucoidin or the seaweed, which contains the fucoidin and it's um, you know, contaminant free. Um, I, can't, I don't think you could say every single place on the planet is contaminant free now because our planet is, you know, in, is, has had pollution and over the years, but particularly Tonga is pretty um, free from contamination. So that's really important because we don't wanna be taking in extra toxins in the ingredients. And of course you would like it to be affordable so that you know you can consume it daily. And if you need to or want to consume, you know, higher dosages of the fucoidin, then you would be able to afford that. So that's really important. So I want to thank Ian today for assisting with the presentation and thank um, everyone for watching the recording. And uh, if you'd like more information, please do get back to the person that shared this information with you and they can uh, help you out there. Uh, so thank you, Ian. Thanks, Katie. Fantastic. Thanks, everyone. Thanks for joining us today. Have a great day.